Today I'm super excited because a package came. Listen, me and my boyfriend are going to Orlando in a few months to go to Universal and Disney World and I may have or have not, this isn't confirmed, you know, allegedly, spent some coin on items that I wanted to get before we went. Um, I bought a couple of bags and an outfit and one of the bags came today and I thought I would unbox it for you and we can kind of take a first peek together and I can give you my thoughts. So let's get right into it. I have this beast. Look at how big this is. This literally, like, what? <laughs> so I did buy this bag from Dolls Kill. I have had my eye on this bag for so long and there's been a couple of different versions on the website like in different colors and then this one came out and I was like, hello, is it me you're looking for? Like that's in exactly what my heart said. Let's get right into it. I know she, she thick with two C's girl, she, she thick. Bag oh, this is quite nice actually. It's got like a bag within a bag within a bag. That's a bag? How many bags? I mean, I don't think we needed this plastic one over top of this, but like, hey, who am I to, who am I to judge? Doll skill? Who am I? Oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so it's in the little mesh coating and. Oh, oh. Good girl, they knotted it. Who knots it? Come on. Ooh. Oh my god. It's such a nice bag. Some of you are gonna just fucking hate this. I can tell already that you're just gonna be like, that's so hideous. Why would you spend any amount of money? It's still too thick, girl. Why would you spend any amount of money on that? Can you tell? Can you tell? Oh, uh, it's like fuzzy. It's got like hair. Is it not sickening? Is it not sickening? Look. And then we've got this little strappy here. I'm gonna do some up close shots in a minute. I'm just gonna finish unpacking it and then I'll be right back. Oh my God, you guys look. Like listen. Okay, I bought this bag as like an airport bag, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, oh my gosh, carry, you know, all your items just very casually through airport security. You don't want to look too flashy, something casual. Okay guys, sorry, uh, let's... Fucking what the fuck. Let's talk about the bag for a minute. So on the sides it does have these pockets that uh, do have a little bit of a like button clasp but it's also a little bit magnetic which is nice. It just makes it easier to close. It does have this long adjustable strap which is nice. You can kind of change the length. I made it just a little bit longer because before it was like sitting like up here. When you open it up. <laughs> Uh, it's got like a zipper pocket on the inside that you'll be able to see from the shots and then two pockets for like your phone or something else and then a lot of room on the inside for whatever else you may be carrying. I do like too that it has the difference in like this strap versus if you just want to carry it because it does have a very like duffel bag sort of style so a uh, your girl likes options it fits good it's made of really nice leather it's not made of anything cheap uh this is like a current mood product so if that's a brand that you're into that's who makes it and yeah i'm super pleased with this um this is a bit on the pricey side it's 50 dollars us um, so I think that came to, it was quite expensive with shipping plus customs plus um, the uh, exchange rate. I'll put whatever the price was here. It didn't take that long to get to me though. I think it took actually less than a week, which is nice because that never happens, especially if you live in Canada. Super pleased with this and I'm super excited to use it and take it with me to Orlando and the airport and all that good stuff. I don't know, it might be a weird size for the airport. I'll have to see. Um, but it does have these things on the bottom, which is nice, so that it never actually 
unless it's super heavy will never actually sit on the floor these kind of help with that and help keep its shape and make sure it sits upright and doesn't slouch over so I do really like all those little details like it is definitely a very well made bag the fur is super thick um, I was expecting it to be a little bit longer kind of more like a shag like a fringe kind of um, I knew it was going to be fur, but I just expected it to be longer, but I still really like how long it is. It doesn't like go over the edge too much, so you shouldn't get it any like wrapping under here if you set it down. Okay, you guys, I forgot to sign off, so it's a lot later. Uh, I've been to the gym, worked out, took off my makeup, but thank you so, so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a big thumbs up. It really helps with the algorithm, just to get that around. Uh, leave any comments down below. What are some like weird items that you're super into that you'd maybe want me to check out, review, we'll see. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. I'm gonna do more of these like alternative, fun sort of style videos, or please follow me on my Instagram. Ugh. <laughs> if uh, you're watching this on IGTV, thanks so much. I'll see you guys in my next video.